Even though oh. Stephanie okay. and Jen. Franky, Kate and Christine. Of course. That's a young black couple. I really want to drop a little bit. Uh, I don't know, but since I don't know what I'm saying, it's all speculation. But I'm gonna put them it's next. It's based on what we've seen so yeah. far. Will and Jasmine, I'm gonna put them second. AJ and Stephanie, I'm gonna put them third. And Kate and Luke, last place. Luke, he's a nice guy. He's not attracted to him. You know, my, all the signals. Yeah, he's being better at no, showing. No, no, no. Explain why everybody's in each position. Okay, Kit and Christine, the attraction is there, physicality is there, financially they're not there. Physicality? Yeah, yeah they're physical. Okay. You know, they're attracted to each other, so okay. that physicality is there. That's financially, like out, they're not there. Like to work out. They're not there, but it's not like he's not doing stuff to better himself. So he's a little slow to the party, to like being financially stable, but he's still 30, he got time. And so, the financial part, it's usually one of the biggest topics people talk about. I don't think about. the biggest thing is the financial, is her picking up all the other baggage in the house. That's yeah, what the issue but would be. Because, as you can see, even... But, no, we just continue your okay. category, categorization. But one thing, the reason I overlooked that, even on taking the lead, he, a lot of time, looks to her and say, is it okay if I say this? Yeah, he does that because he's pretty much waiting for her to be the mom and, and the grandma. And so I, I she, like, they, she can make all the decisions. That's what I'm saying. That's going to get annoying to her because she's going to want a man who can make the decisions too. Who doesn't want a man who doesn't make any decisions? Yeah, but I feel like... Come on. You like, want a man to take charge at times. I feel like she'll be able to transform that. We'll see. I just feel like we'll she could see. do that. Okay. AJ and Will, they have everything. I mean, AJ and Will. Oof. <laughs> Will and Jasmine, they're second because they definitely have great communication. They're attracted to each other, even though they're not physical yet. Financially, they're both stable. And, you know, I feel like everything is good, but that physicality is a big issue. But again, we don't know the full detail. We don't know why we was waiting because I don't think they're still trying to get to know each other. We already feel like they've talked about each other more than any other couple. Mm -hmm. So I don't think that's what it is. I feel like it's something that Will is carrying and he can't get over his head and I think he just needs to communicate and he's just scared how Jasmine would take it. Or maybe he just doesn't want to have that conversation on TV. You see what I'm saying? So it could be that. Okay, third, you have AJ and Stephanie. We love Stephanie. She actually proved us wrong in the beginning. She looked like she'd be super stuck up, stuck up, tense. Not stuck up like... Oh yeah, that's true, yeah. Almost like a workaholic, no time for fun. There you go. But she's really Perfect goofy, way to explain and it. what happens is AJ just flips so much that he'll be happy, but then he'll Hot just snap and at cold. people. I feel like he's gonna do that so many times at Stephanie, and Stephanie's gonna back away. Mm-hmm. And honestly, they might stay a little bit longer because he'll snap, but then he'll be good at talking to be like, "Hey, I'm sorry," I'm sorry. you know, saying exactly. But she's not going to be happy. Yes, Especially can. unless she's able to say, this has to stop or like be able to address that. Uh-huh. But that's why I feel third because, because she doesn't talk and talk about her feelings, especially when he's doing something that she doesn't agree with. That's a big issue because that's communication. Uh-huh. And then you have Kate and Luke. Defender. <laughs> I mean, defender. <laughs> yeah, defender. <laughs> Actually, no, he's defend that. Yeah, defend <laughs> he's that. Him, uh, that. Cause Kate is like the perfect wife, <laughs> ready for everything. <laughs> I think, honestly, Kate might be the perfect woman wife in regards to how she's dealing with Luke. I don't think any of the other three girls would be as patient as she oh, would no, be. No, I yeah. think everybody else would have been like, Heck no. Mm-hmm. There's no way I'm... No. Mm-hmm. Especially if you tell me something like that, none of them are going to take it like that. And I feel like she's just ready and, you know, she's submissive and she's ready to just say, look, you know what? I want to work it out. She's And so I hope it's not like where she allows herself to get pushed around. But I hope not. it shows that she's patient and, you know, she really wants this to work. So 
I feel like she's, if any marriage ever broke up with the other three girls, I feel like, hey, for any reason, they could end up ending it. I feel this one, if it ends, it's really all Luke. Luke is the one that would just push it to the extreme and just we want to do whatever. And no, he, he, he's not physically attracted to her. He doesn't seem to want to be in a relationship with her. He looks at her like, hey, like a little sister or like a friend, but not somebody he'd want to date. Sure. And, you know, physicality doesn't seem the strongest, but this one is more than physicality. It's like, I don't, I don't feel like being... I still something think big. something could change. Yeah. On that case, we'll do my ranking. Yes. I feel like I have a harder time with the rankings than you do. I feel like you're super confident, but... I think my number one is still Will and Jasmine. Mm -hmm. I think, even though they have, it's physicality, I feel like it's still early. I'm giving them time, okay? Mm -hmm. I'm not. To me, that's not an issue. That's it's assessment. an issue for them, but I feel like long run, she'll be like, "I'm glad we waited." Yeah, so that's fine. That's fine. Will and Jasmine. Then it's. Who is, it? Who is it? Christine and Keith. Keith. I was about to say Keith. Christine, <laughs> Christine and Keith. Keith. Yeah, I can't speak. So I can't figure out their names. I think they are second. Mm -hmm. Only because I feel like even though his whole issue will be Christine, you do everything he may be able to change his mind or he's gonna realize he really wants a relationship he's not the mother he has to pull up his weight i think he'll eventually catch on so he went to number their number two third is luke and kate i don't know why i'm still hopeful i feel like right now it's horrible eh but it could turn around you know because sometimes Who? luke and kate a shindle. <laughs> and for those who know you know I'm not giving you any any definitions. Go look it up. Google. It's Google is free. Really. Google is free. No, Google is free. A Shindwe. You have to say which language it is. No, they can find out. How are you going to find out which it's, language it is? It's a new is? age, man. Everything is too easy. Anyway, I, <laughs> I really think, you know, because my thing is at the end of the day, some relationships in the beginning, example, like those hardcore people who actually do, um, they get married, the day of that's when they meet and everything sometimes it starts off rough but you just gotta be patient and i feel like kate is very patient and eh? that eventually luke will be able to realize oh my goodness he has something good in front of him so i really think he could change it out he could change he won't realize till after it's done well whether it's after it's done the point is is if they make it this is the whole point of it yes. and i I'm, I'm i'm hopeful I'm not a hard, I'm hopeful, if I guess. Then I think it's Stephanie and AJ. They haven't had a serious conversation. I, I, have you even had anything? No, I, I have like no, they don't have a serious conversation. And I feel like if you can't have those conversations, or oh, 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 I think about the time they did have a conversation about moving, he blew up in her immediately. Yeah. Like he couldn't even finish a sentence without him blowing up. Going on. And any serious topic say it seems like that's gonna be an issue. And, and it's not even that serious as a thing. Mm -hmm. It's just something so little. Oh, I don't wanna compliment. I don't know what to say to compliment her. Why are you wing it on me and got so mad over something so little? Little like that, you're getting mad, you're gonna get mad over something that's a little bit bigger. And I just realized he's gonna be blowing up all the time and it's gonna just push Stephanie just like I can't deal with your bipolar, hot and cold type attitude, personality. Like, but that's my ranking. That's your ranking. Yeah. We have we said every episode we can change our rankings. Our rankings mm -hmm. until like midway. That's when we're gonna have to lock it in, and we'll see how it happens at the end. I think we've changed every episode. I think we've changed our ranking. I think so. I feel like we've changed every time. Every single episode. But I I have to say that the only ones consistently. It's Kate and Luke. Last place. That no. I feel that one has for no you, move for me. I feel like the ones who have been really consistent, eh? But the only reason they've moved and it's only been for this season 
eh? I mean, this episode, it's Will and Jasmine. Yeah, they are, they've moved for me just... This is fun. Actually, they moved for me last episode. No, you did not move them to number two. Who did you put first? You did not. Okay, this is the first time you did. Uh, the way this because they started having that conversation last episode yeah but but I, I i was telling you that i'm not i'm still not worried eh i still think no but no i was saying this is the first time you can't do that but yeah, I, yeah. other than that i think they're pretty solid at the top all right but all right see you next, all right, guys. See you next week yep